Everybody, what's going on? We're doing a draft. I couldn't think of what to do on Magic Online or Magic Arena, so I just doing a draft here. I will purchase this item. It's been a while since I've done just a good old-fashioned Ravnica Allegiance draft, so maybe they're okay again. We'll figure it out. What are we taking? Biogenic Upgrade? Sar Farm Hybrid? Vindictive Vampire? A Dagger Caster, perhaps? How about Font of Agonies, ladies and gentlemen? Whenever you pay life, you may put that many blood counters on Font of Agonies. You can also remove four blood counters and put this card directly into the trash can. So that is an option. Don't forget. Right into the trash can. I'm going to take the Biogenic Upgrade. Despite how good Sorform Hybrid is, this card is just... It's what's known as uh, OP. Hmm? Yes. Spirit of the Spire is also good. Dovin's Acuity could be fine. Lavinia is not great and limited. It's just a 2-2 two, two for 2 with a restrictive mana cost. I might just take the Rend, the Rend Horn. It keeps us on color. Dovin, Dovin's Acuity. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, none of these cards. Like, I, I think this card's great, but I don't think it's worth going into a second color for it. Especially when white-green is not a combination, so we'd basically be giving up our first pick for it. This pack also does not excite me. But it, it, there's nothing great in this pack anyway. I might just take Gruel Guildgate, which could put us in red-green. I think it's better than either of these, which are probably the two cards I'm leaning towards heavily. Clamor Shaman's also nice, actually. I do like a Clamor Shaman, actually. I'm going to take the Shaman. Oh, and then followed by a Zerta Goblin? Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're really just hoping for all the rhythms that we can get. I'm going to take Rebel Belt Runner because it's like the only thing we care about. Wrecking Beast is fine, but uh, it's whatever. I'd rather have a, a three drop than... Oh, Swirling Torrent. God, Teamer, you'd be talking to me. You'd be speaking my language. This is only one blue. And I think it's, it's, it's head and shoulders above our three options in this pack. So I'm going to take this and maybe we just splash it. We'll see. Rubble Slinger is fine. Gravel Hide's actually fine here now. I also like Arrester's Admonition. Hmm. Opponent in ranked standard just played Clamor Shaman. Get wrecked, my dude. Do get wrecked. Hold on. Okay, I have a deck I was working on in Modern. It is Heartless Summoning. Want to see it? I'll post it in chat. Yeah, except it's going to have four ensnaring bridges because you're a troll. So here's the thing. We either have to decide to commit to the blue because the Arrestor's Ammunition is a, a top tier common. Or we can just take like a Gravel Hide Goblin here. I've been impressed by the Goblin Index with Sorrowform. Really? How so? Why so? What's the, re what's the, what's the connection there? All right, I want to take the Goblin because you guys believe in it. Oh, Titanic Brawl is nice. Oh, another Rubble Belt Runner? Okay. This guy's doing a lot of running. Keep on running. I'm going to take this Rakdos Locket just in case. I don't see us ever playing Tower Defenses. Yeah, this pack's not great either. Okay. Yep, you're fine. You're playable, but not. I'm not thrilled about you. Oh, another Lavinia. Fantastic. Absolutely spectacular. Thankfully, there is a Savage Smash, which is probably the most playable card in this pack for us. And I'm definitely taking a Smash over a potential Simic Guildgate for a card we might not play, but... Yeah, I'll take Frenzy Larynx. Oh, Sorform Hybrid, you are top tier. I like Sorform Hybrid better than Scorchmark, actually. I mean, this guy becomes a 6-6, six, six, which is really hard. I'm not gonna take I'm not gonna take Carnage just because, like. I'm already trying to splash blue. I don't really need another card that I'm trying to splash when there's a definitely a good enough pick. I also don't think it's that great. I mean, you just really don't play you don't play Mind Rot in Limited that frequently. And Carnage is great because it is it's more versatile and it does three damage, but like, it's not huge. Frenzied? Oh, you're a little behind, I think. Um, yeah, I could take the Rumbling Room, but we already have Biogenic Upgrade and Swirling Torrent. I'm going to take the 2-drop. That is just a premier 2-drop, gentlemen. Um, don't care, don't care, don't care. 
don't care. We're just going to take the Guild Gate here because it lets us play Swirling Torrent. And now we do have to take our I'm not going to take either one. Any one of these is not great. This card is so... It's so ridiculous, especially when you look at the... Um, <coughs> it's funny because... Um, you look at... I, you know, I got to see it in the, in the Ravnica Remix drafts on Magic Online. And um, it's funny when you look at it because... The the equivalent in Guilds of Ravnica was the two two, the Dovakin dissident, dissident or something, um, and it was a two two for five mana. You can pump it plus two plus two, so it was a two two that you can spend five mana on to make it a, uh, four four. Right, this is a card you can spend six mana on, and make it a six six forever, not just once. Dovakin is it not Dovakin? I, I keep I always get it confused with the uh, the Elder Scrolls. You like Biomancy over Admonition? Interesting. I like bio, I like Admonition better just because I like drawing a card. Like they they both bounce, but the plus one plus one I think is worse than drawing a card. So that's interesting. They are both very good. I agree with that. This is actually the toughest pick because I think they're both good. It was Dragonboard, that's true. I think I'm on board. It's almost like you said I think I'm on board. Well, they're both they're both easy to splash. I mean they're both single blue, right? And if we're if green is our main color, then they're both the same. Um I'm gonna take admonition. I think it's I just like it as a better well, see look. I'm gonna take hybrid over admonition, second admonition for sure. Uh I do like a mammoth spider. Simic Guildgate's probably where we're gonna be now with multiple blue cards Some, oh yes yes I actually meant to I meant to double click on that to, to zoom in like magic online and that's why it accidentally picked it so I apologize if we didn't see the, the pack that thoroughly but I'm gonna take third guild gate here look the carnage carnival came back believe it or not it's gonna go right in the sideboard eh, actually I like rumbling ruin here I like having a six drop that's solid steeple creeper now has gone up in value because of the the blue splash, Axbane guy, probably not making the cut. Gift of Strength is nice. Mm -hmm. Wow, that was a late Stony Strength too that I'm pretty good with. Um, I actually like Gatebreaker here because we do have three Guild Gates. And if we can pick up any more guild gates, either Gruel or Simic, I'm okay with it. I think it's probably better uh, than Arrestor's Admonition. Probably better than Renhorn. Second Rhythm of the Wild, probably good. I don't know, maybe. <sighs> if either one of these comes back, I'll be fine with it. So I'm just going to take the second Rhythm. We always end up with two Rhythms, and then we never end up drawing them in our matches. So, yeah, another Simic Guild Gate. Let's keep guild gating until we can no longer guild gate. Wow, another some guild gate. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, I'm gonna take the scorch mark here though because we have four some guild gates and we have no real uh, removal. And I think some uh, scorch mark is probably one of the better ones. Um, I'm pretty sure we're just gonna take collision colossus here because it lets us it lets us take out either gift or stony or maybe both. Because it's just a better trick that also ends up killing your your opponent's things. Uh, what are we not playing here? Axeman, I'm kind of on the fence about because it's not great. Everything else seems fine. I like Skewer a lot. I've also been a big fan of Daggercaster, but I think it has to be Skewer here. So, I, I understand. Oh, Gruel Guildgate is nice. So is Scorchmark and Ren Renhorn. Both of those are very, very good. Hold on, I'm getting a call. I'm gonna check the... I'm gonna check this voicemail real quick, hold on. Okay. Well, I don't know if that's real. 
iPhone or Android? I have an Android. I haven't had an Android for a long time. We also do need another 5 drop. I think it's actually Rendhorn here. We don't have many 5 drops. Oh, well, speak of the devil. Had I known we were getting a Robo Belt Recluse next, I would have probably just gone with the other guy. You should see the other guy. Also, let's talk about how sick Double Rhythm and Biogenic Upgrade are together. Okay, this deck looks pretty sweet. We do have to make two cuts. Oh, we got a treasure? Treasure chest? I'm opening this bad boy now. Okay, cool. Is the treasure chest all the same? Am I always getting one and two? That's that's fine, I guess. Well, no, I didn't want to do that. Okay, this is a lot of three drops. <clears throat> like an un unreasonable amount. How many creatures are we looking at here? 15 creatures? Dang. You probably cut one of these six drops. I don't like it, though. So we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, eight. Actually, that's pretty good as far as, as, far as that goes. <laughs> ah, excuse me. Um, <laughs> if it was a real treasure chest, it might have like a book in it. That does sound better. You don't like Rubble Slinger? I guess we can board it in if they have like floaty boys. And now I need to cut like one one more card. Or we can just play 41 because that's that's what I'm okay with. Oh god, I'm, I'm so okay with it. Let's just do it. Well, this is the problem. All right, <clears throat> I'll keep this. Deck does look nice. I'm a fan of it. Care to give a few examples of the times when you make a 41 card deck over a 40 card deck or just when you can't decide? Uh, it's literally both. <clears throat> um, yep, keeping that on top, even though we are on the play. So we're just hoping to draw a land off the top for turn three. Um, so <clears throat> I actually I literally mentioned this in my article that's coming up on Wednesday on Cool Stuff, where you can use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. But... Um, the thing is, I'll never play 61 cards in Constructed, but I will often play 41 in Limited. The reason being that Limited is a different beast, right? Like, you're not you're not choosing which cards you're going to put in your deck. You're actually having to, to select from a very small pool. And you need different things at different times. Like, I'll need cards like Savage Smash. I'll need cards like Scorchmark. I'll need Creatures. I'll need Bombs like Rhythm of the Wild, you know? So, like... There's always, like, I could cut something like a crushing canopy from the main deck and go down to 40 cards, but there's definitely situations where I'm going to need this in different games. So, you, you like, there's, there's the old adage where you just cut your 41st card because you cut your worst card. You know, there's always going to be a worse card, but, like, in, so, in certain situations, there's not because you're going to need different cards for different things. Like, is a scorch mark better than... Watch, it's going to be four lands. Wow, three lands. Okay, and that's going to be good for us. Hey, it worked out. <clears throat> is a scorch mark worse than a crushing canopy? Sometimes. Is it better? Sometimes. 
Like, do you need a way to kill a 4-4 four, four flyer sometimes and not a 2-2 two, two ground creature? Yeah, definitely. So, I mean, like, it comes to, it comes down to, like, there's a situation where, like, there's not going to always be a worse card in your limited deck, a 41st card for you to cut. Sometimes you want to have access to all these effects at different times. So you just run 41 on the small chance that you might draw something in the wrong order or not, you know, as opposed to not drawing it at all ever. You know what I mean? So... <clears throat> Uh, well. Two of those lands were tapped, but they were also gates for the Gatebreaker Worm, so... Gatebreaker Ram, not Worm, I guess. Oh, that's a good dude. I mean, I'm tempted to actually just make this a 4-4 and, and just smash. This seems strong. You got this 0-4 wall, but you don't even want to block? Hmm, that's unfortunate. If we hit a land, we can go Savage Smash your, like, your blocker, or Scorch Mark your 3-2, and then I think we're in good shape. I like keeping a variety of options, but I will rarely ever play 42. I think you definitely want to to maximize your odds of hitting your best card every turn. I think that is true. However, I do think there are different there are different cards that are going to be your best card in different situations. Oh, like me. <clears throat> God, Jeff, you're the worst. Yeah, I don't think that's going to really do much here, but... This Rendhorn being a 5-5 Hasty Boy is pretty good. It's basically a charging Monstrosaur. Dragosi, what's going on, buddy? Thanks so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. <clears throat> welcome, welcome. What do you got here? A bunch of nerds? Yeah, we're just going to counter on this guy. So they can actually quadruple block one of these guys, but then they go to four. Then we get to kill, like, Skatewing Spy, I guess. Mm. I think that's actually fine. Here we go. That yeah, quad blocks. There we go. You did it. You're not gonna block with the wall? Yeah, this will be. This will be. Fun. I mean, Erinx who did like eight damage and you know trading for your four drop plus four drop for four drop, and this guy already did like a thousand damage, so. Boom, 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 boom. One, one. I'll taste it up. <laughs> see. See what you got here. This is literally, I'm not even doing the math. I'm just turning these guys sideways because they're friggin' huge. <clears throat> yep, definitely killing that guy. I think this game's done. These guys are both lethal, and uh, this guy is uh, kills probably anything, including that little bird. We don't have to use it now. Like we can give them one more turn and just attack with the hybrid. Yeah, they can't double block this guy, so we're actually just gonna give it haste. Oh, 
Got him. <clears throat> this guy heard flyers are good. <clears throat> hey, you guys, uh... You guys got flyers? See, now we're gonna bring in this rubble stinger over this rubble belt runner. One rubble, one good rubble deserves another, is what I always say. Uh, also, the Hamburglar says this. Giving a, some dude's reach is also pretty pretty nice. I like I like a good reachy boy. That just sounds weird. Did you hear him say he likes a good reachy boy? What does that even mean? Oh, I don't know. That's good. I don't actually think I care about Scorch Mark, to be quite honest. Like, they didn't seem like they had a bunch of two toughness creatures that are really going to get wrecked by it. Why did he beat me to death? Pepe hands. <laughs> oh, crying out loud. <clears throat> oh, Scorch Marker around my Lambo. Uh, I thought this, I thought the name was col Colonoscopies, and I'm still not sure that it's not meant to be Colonoscopies. Uh, yeah, we're on the draw. We can keep this. Nailed it. This is what it sounds like when an opponent cries. Oh, that was Tommy Wiseau, not Black Betty. Oh, my bad. Oh, oh, Scorch Mark. Oh, I, I like a high Scorch Mark better than oh, Scorch Mark. I don't want to replace high with Scorch. I just want to... Quench this like a biscuit city. That's better because I can't get around that. Yeah, never punished is not the phrase I'd use for to describe my magic experience. That's rude. Oh, Black Betty, do 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 do. <clears throat> yeah, I guess so. It's probably the same thing, right? Baby shark, do 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 do. I kind of want to put this on top and return this to my hand. How do we feel about that? Pretty good, right? Target creature on top of its owner's library. This guy, return to the owner's hand. Uh, this guy. Are you going to quench this? Oh, do not quench. Oh, you did not quench. I would like to attack you for three. Occasionally not punished. Yeah, that sounds better. That sounds more accurate. Baby shark. Uh, doesn't matter. Actual doesn't matter. That's really sad. Remember that time I had a board state? Me too. <clears throat> oh boy. The times they are changing. This guy's just better than this guy at this point. Like I, I wanna spend, cause if we get another land we can play both of these. How many years Frank's played Magic? Uh, I've played Magic for probably about 20,000 years, I think. <clears throat> I've played Magic for 900 years! Ah, 
After 10,000 years of playing magic, I'm finally free! Oh. Um, so this guy's just gonna come in with the sickness. Is that right? This guy's just gonna get up, come on, get down with the sickness, do you think? So we get to play 4-4 four, four Ram and also Fighty Boy. So it's three, so it's be a five. Yeah, we can just smash. There hasn't been magic around here for nigh on 45 years. Oh, I'll block with my little bird. Ah. 10,000 years gives you such a crick in the neck. Malta. Ah. 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 Oh boy. Hold on, I gotta take out my glasses for this one. Woo! Woo! <clears throat> so what, they gain two? They got four whole mana up? Why do you have that? We're gonna attack first. Three and two. Show me what you got. Okay, well, that's fine. I actually don't have any power, so... I have no power! Whatever. Eh. So here we go, we're gonna play this guy with a counter on it. We'll play this guy. And then next turn... We are gonna go go to town. Leroy Brown. Whatever that means. Oh, magic. I haven't had that name in a long time. It's been nigh on forty-five years. One, two, three. So they're gonna put us to seven. And then we gotta be like, hey man, you gotta block. If you were a magic card, what magic card would you be and why? I'd be Mystic Snake. No, I'd be Leovold. I'd be Leovold for sure, my dude. 6, 10, 11, 12. So you actually have to block something if we upgrade here. Even if we don't upgrade, you still have to block something. 6, 79, 10, 1, 2, 3. I think we're just putting counters on everything, right? Even if you don't, you have to block one of the big guys too, or else you're just dead to the, the hybrid, my dude. <laughs> Can I ask what graphics card you're running? I'm running a Vegas 64, but whenever I have Arena with another thing. Uh, my graphics card is... It's a good one. I'm going to link you to it. So that you'll know. This is the graphics card. It's actually doubled in price because of Bitcoin things, but... Uh, wait, how are they not... Okay, I was like, how are they not dead? I don't understand. <coughs> they are dead. Oh, let's let's claim this. Let's open this pack and see if we can get a thousand year storm. We can't because that's a Guilds of Ravnica card and not a Ravnica. Actually, do we have? I think we might actually have all of the. I think we might actually have all of the mythics in Ravnica Allegiance, which is kind of sad. Oh, that's sad. 
How does Bitcoin affect price? Uh, the, so the big the thing with Bitcoin was people were buying up high powered graphics cards in mass because they would have they would set up these huge Bitcoin mining rigs, these machines that were solely used to mine Bitcoins. So you need a lot of processing power. So they were just buying graphics cards in bulk, which uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Increase the price. So graphics cards kept going up o over time over the past like few years. Um, because they were, there was just such a high demand for them. Eh, I'll reluctantly keep this hand. Hey, it's a two drop, I guess. Yeah, people were running like eight graphics cards to mine Bitcoin. Was, uh, so it's like, instead of buying like one graphics card, the market had people needing like eight graphics cards. But the graphics card industry is like, you're not just going to make a million graphics cards. You just make a, a good amount because people don't need multiples usually. So, you know. I don't really want a rhythm off the top here. I'd rather have a forest. Uh, no block. Oh, I'm 100% sure that people spent more money on the graphics cards than they did actually mining the Bitcoin. Mining Bitcoin is an ex is an extremely slow and expensive process. Let's get in there. What do you got? You gonna trade? I'll trade. What does little man say? <laughs> Mao. Um, this is actually seems like a fine trade, I'll be honest with you. Can we update that that command to just have the link? Just have the uh, the Twitch link. Well, we don't have anything to play here. Oh, this was terrible. I thought it was going to die. Oh, I should have done it on this guy. That, we should have scorched mark. That was terrible. I actually did the math wrong because I was thinking of the little man. That was so bad. So bad. Like, what's the sound a little man makes? Mao. <laughs> oh god, that's such a that's such a thing. I mean, apparently we're still doing okay here. I would love to hit a, a fourth, fifth, or sixth land. Or, you know, all three, I guess. But... Give me a Simic Guildgate here. I'll just take it so I can get... Oh, I guess they could pump this guy. There's a lot of Guildgates they have here. I'm not thrilled with what they're, what they're... What kind of shenanigans they're trying. Can they still pump? One, two, three, four. Yes, they can. So, we'll just attack with this guy, and if they want to trade him, I'm okay with it. Well, I do have a six drop, so I'm okay with I'm okay with hitting a six land. But if the arrangement is that we only hit five lands, I'll I'll, I'll take it because we have a four, five, and five, so I'm okay with it. Tanos, what's going on, buddy? Welcome back. It's your buddy Tanos. Long time no see, Moan Frere. Okay, well that's good. That's a good deal. What is that noise? Whoa! What is that noise that it makes? 
Not been around much a lot. How are things? Things are going all right. No complaints. <laughs> Who would listen anyway, you know? <laughs> oh, boy. So this is what they, they would just trade here instead. I guess we just play our own Arynx. I mean, if we draw lands, our hand is obviously better than their one card. Unless their last card is like a Hydroid Crassus, and they're like, let me wait till I get my blue guild gate. Oh, they already have it, so. So much poop. I don't really feel like attacking with anything here, so I'm gonna say nay. I will decline. Tell us how things have been, buddy. Good, I hope. I hope you not being around does not have any negative connotations. New Gemma, thank you so much for hanging out, buddy. Have a good, uh, have a good afternoon thing. You know, like you do. Like you do. All right, so now they're just giving me all the lands, which is kind of nice. I'm kind of a fan of that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They can pump this guy twice, making it a six, five. That I'm not a fan of. Well, I feel like we're doing well here. Only connotation is that I've been busier at with work and haven't had as much time where I can even throw a stream up on a second monitor. Nothing bad, just trying to get some stuff shipped. Um, yeah, but that seems that seems like a good problem to have, right? So I would I would associate that with being uh, being positive, not not negative. So that's that's good to hear. Oh, I see. You're just getting aggressive here. Oh, I get it. Oh, I get it. I'm just gonna block here. So you're going to have to pump twice if you want to save your guy. If you pump once, you're going to trade, so. Oh, that's... Uh, we have three mana left. Oh, Jesus. I want to build a loam growth spiral ghost quarter deck. What's gross? Go growth spiral. I was like, what's growth spiral? Yep, that was rough. So was it one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Is it three for five? It's not ideal. You're going to attack here? Nah, B. It ain't me, B. No, no. Ain't me all looking for. You got it. All right, so now they have three power on board. We're at eight. If they play a f like a worm, we're dead. Like a wrecking wrecking worm. I came in like a wrecking worm. I'm gonna play around quench here. <laughs> I don't want to get quenched on. Alright, seems good. Why do the Bitcoin guys buy 8 1080 Ti's instead of 1 or 2 NVIDIA Ti? Um, because I think you're still getting more power out of 8 1080 Ti's because you're not overloading any one individual card. That would be my theory. Fascinating. Yeah, the 1080s were a lot cheaper, and I think when it was when it was happening, I don't even know if Teslas were available at the time. Alright, let's keep in mind they have a thing. Why do I keep getting calls from this number?
I'm just gonna submit like this. I don't think we actually have a problem. I will keep this hand. Take him down, FBI! <laughs> oh my god. He's got a knife! Alright, let me see what this message is now. I'm getting a lot of calls from 844 area codes today. Eight second voicemail with no actual content. Seems legit. Was it just heavy breathing? Because that might have been me. Um, well, if you don't know whether it was you for sure, you're clearly not devoting your efforts to the heavy breathing as uh, as well as you could be. Oh, that was a good that was a good hit. Future lands are looking good now, boys. Um, I'm gonna no attack here. I heard the best thing to do if I roll calls is to answer and then leave the phone alone so the roll call thinks the line. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. I'll trade for one of these guys. I think that's totally fine. <clears throat> okay, this is this is taking up your turn, so. Land or thing that I can cast. Another five drop? Fantastic. That was actually really good. I think if we have uh I think if we clog our hand up with five drops, it's actually really good because then eventually uh we'll get to lose the game, which is pretty cool. So Hello? You've reached Milos. Why you call phone? I could just do a Russian voice. That's pretty good. Oh, in Russian. Wow. <laughs> wow, that's... Yeah, that's much different. Yep, this is the game. Let's go to the next game, I guess. You think this is bad neighborhood? Yeah, Russian. You know, Russian. Everybody knows that. Come on with these hands. Okay, this is actually where I want to be. <laughs> what part of the Philippines are you from? Hilarious. Actual hilarious. Man, this is the moment where I wish I spoke another language. T cool, thank you so much. Good, good to see you, buddy. Did I say that correctly? I actually don't know, and now I feel bad.
Oh, I had a feeling it wasn't a joke. I definitely had a feeling you were being serious. Uh, let's make it 4 4, I guess. Well, this guy's problematic. I don't care about that guy. Yikes. That's a yikes from me, doggo. Alright, well. Wow, they only have six cards in hand? That's pretty crazy. Okay, I'm, I've saved this. <clears throat> I've saved this. Uh, this Tanos link for. Okay, well. Okay, that was. Oh, that's that's real good. Oh, that's insane. Um. Well, that was pretty good. And this is why we play the uh, Swirling Torrent. When I used to live in Japan, I would get calls to my office phone, which is unusual. Uh, so I would always answer in English. It was a telemarketer. They would just hang up. If a person actually needed to talk to me, they would stumble on in crappy English. Then I would switch to Japanese. Haste, huh? So we have six mana. So if we hit any two or three drop to go with this Rhythm of the Wild, it'd be great. Uh, if we hit a five or six drop, that's also fine. The worst thing we could probably draw is a land. And it was a land. Well... We could make this guy and we say 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then they pump this guy, 11, 12. If they have a gate and they pump this guy, we're just dead. So I'm going to no attack here. Really hoping we, uh. Burning Tree Vandal's totally fine. Like a 3 2 for 3 that loots is just. It's totally fine. It's not like a. Can we just draw like 6 6? Alright, well. 1, 2, 3, 4. I mean, I guess that's a thing, right? Here, quench this. Be hilarious. Is it twelve twelve? Wow. Well, that's cool. Good game. Must be nice. I'm a fan of drawing lands, so when I don't get to do that, I actually feel like I'm uh, not having a good time.
keep. Any hand with a rhythm and at least two lands is probably pretty key. To play. Yeah, that's better. Now I'm just now the question is do we just wait to play this guy on turn four? Maybe. Uh, I think that makes our choice easier because now we have a land to play. First play is a locket. Ours is a rhythm. Thank you. Tiger Nate, welcome back. 13 months in a row. Really appreciate it, buddy. Shoulder touch. Hey. <laughs> oh, fantastic. That's good stuff. Next. So we get to trade our four drop, our two drop for your four drop. That seems like a good value. Did we not actually go to the turn? I thought we were done. I guess because I had a thing, it wasn't done. I was looking over here. I was looking away. Then he looked away. Oh, we are in the opponent's turn. Okay, good. Um, I'm probably just going to block here. I feel like my creatures are head and shoulders better in the future. Alright, let's charging monster sore them. See if they have a final payment. Joke's on you, they always have a final payment. They didn't have that? Okay. Yeah, this is actually why I assumed they attacked last turn because they wanted to play Blade Juggler, but if they didn't have it... They didn't play it last turn, right? So, it's... Uh... We don't have Smash Mana, so I guess this is fine. Can we just talk about how broken Rhythm of the Wild is? Look at this idiot. Shut up and take my money. And like that, I've got to run to follow some bugs and write some more docs. Good luck with the car. Thanos, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Unbelievable. You are ridiculous. And hopefully I'll see you again soon because you're an awesome dude to have around. Good luck with your files and your bugs and your docs. Really appreciate it, buddy. All right. So we're going to go one, two. Uh, I guess we're going to go one, two, right? 
Put two on this one, one on this guy. Submit it like that. Actually, this guy with the trample probably would have just killed him if we put it all on here, right? Because then they would have to block. Oh, I guess they're just going to die anyway. Thanos OP. Really appreciate it, buddy. see any necessary changes here. N -n 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 necessary changes turn and face the change. The strange. Keep Keep Arenos. Guild Gato. Turn and face the strange changes. Um, let's play this guy and play Ibrino. Thank you, Valtrex Pomegranate. Thanks so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Your ad here. <laughs> Oh, good times, good times. Speaking of my ad, if you guys have not done so, definitely check out Mana Traders. If you need to borrow physical cards, paper, actual paper cards, if you want to rent, uh, if you want to rent or borrow Magic Online cards for your decks, uh, if they, they actually have a subscription service, and you get 20% off the first three months if you use the link and promo code in my description. So definitely check those out. Manatraders.com. Or, similarly, you can go to MeUndies.com slash Frank Laporte, and you'll get 15% off your entire purchase, plus free shipping, which is a pretty good deal. I don't know if you guys, I don't know if you guys know a good deal when you see it, but it's a good deal. Land. That's not a land at all. I asked for a land. They gave me nothing. MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. 15% off the whole order. And their, their stuff is super comfortable too, so. If that's a thing that interests you, be interested. Alright, well, Seraph of the Scales is rough in this particular situation that we are currently in. But next time we can Savage Smash this dude and then not not worry about the tokes. You got one white mana. What's the hold up here? I don't understand. I'm confused. From 1 to 10, how will Demandis cup the sco the Scotal area? Uh, If you want to trade here when I have three mana, that's totally fine. Otherwise, these. I did know what you meant. I just didn't say scrotal area. Um, yeah, that's fine. I feel like we're in good shape here. I don't know. 
Bear. I hate this cat. Oh, I hate this cat. Cat. I hate this cat. Oh, that's 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 nice. Let's go, 1-1 one, one counter, and haste. Pop him in the red zone. Are you gonna draw two cards? Oh, these are gonna have a combat three? Oh my god, I'm so tired of Blade Brand. Another situation where if we had like just one fourth land on turn 7,000, we would be able to Titanic Brawl because that's cool. Ch -ch changes. Time may change me, but all you have is removal spells, and I don't even have lands for my deck. I'm just gonna haste this dude up right now. Get him for three. Got him. Got him. Get wrecked. Anyone can see the road that they... That's actually... I'm, this is less concerning to me because we do have, like, Swirling Torrent for it later. That cat seemed very good. I don't know why I get rid of that cat. It's paved in gold. Well, it's always summer. They'll never get cold. Um... Someone just discovered the shuffler was broken? Can you link to that? Because that's interesting. I would love to know how they discovered that, but I'm very curious. Like, I feel like we have to have something to block this guy next turn, so I think we're just going to go Renhorn with two counters on it. Pop, pop. No attacks here. I like Goblin plus Creeper, but like... I want to keep the creeper to actually do some damage in the air. Like next turn, we can creeper and gets past this guy as a as a big boy. So now we can actually play both. We can only play one guy actually. Mm, that's unfortunate. Hey guys, just let her. Mm. Wait, what? Why would you tap the red for that? Uh, 
put you on top, put you in the hand. So you have to block one of these two and just die. So now you go to negative one. All right. Well, they can either play this guy or their big dude. Or activate this. So they can't do all three. Oh yeah, I definitely I definitely skipped the Desolator video and just went straight to the uh, the Reddit post because that seems much more interesting. Uh, Alright, our next seems okay. Appreciate the heads up though. <clears throat> the one in the highway. Yep, that's a mulligan. That's a sneaker. Oh, shaker of milks. I spent about 2,000 in the past week and a half. 2,100 in the past two weeks on car stuff. So... Uh, the first one was 900, then I actually had to get a new hybrid battery, and I had to get a new, uh, my combination meter had to be fixed. It was just repaired, so it was 300 bucks. So it was two, it was we, it was back-to-back -back weeks of about 1,000 bucks and stuff. So, um, we were really ahead on rent, so I just figured whatever, whatever happens is going to the, the, to the car repair, so. And again, as I always say, this is not me asking you guys to pay for my car stuff. This is just me saying if you donate and you support the stream, that's where it's going to go. That's what I'm going to be spending it on. Why do I have fastball the way stuck in my head? This guy's obnoxious, but us getting our guy back when it dies is pretty good. What are you driving a leaf? What does that mean? I'm, I'm driving a Prius that has 200,000 miles on it. And the hybrid battery alone costs $700. So, Plus I got new tires, which were $500. Uh, I got a new 12 volt battery and a new serpentine belt, which was about 400 bucks in total. And I mean, it just adds up. It's a bunch of different services, a bunch of different labors. So. Frank made up his mind and he started streaming. Went up before the mic woke up that day. Oh, I see. And you can pump this guy? Serpentine belt sounds fake. <laughs> it does actually. I'm like, a serpentine belt? Oh my god. Casper, you have not missed a short plus hat stream yet. Well, that's an unfortunate draw. Maybe, maybe it's not. No attacks. Hey, don't be telling people about my disco record collection, buddy. An exit to eternal magic memeing. Wow, this is actually a solid, uh, solid rendition of the way by, by fastball. No, blocker. But where was he going without ever knowing the way? Everyone can be in my 
tank. I'm just gonna play this guy because it leaves us less susceptible. Like if we if we pump this guy and then they just bounce it, it's pretty bad. Because we have to do that. Like po we'll block and then they'll bounce this guy and then we just lose this guy. Where eh, I guess it doesn't matter. I don't know. Got a problem with your sandwich gasket rubbing up against your hot dog valve. <laughs> Yeah, which is funny because you can tell they're not the same part. That's how you know that hot dogs aren't sandwiches because they're two different parts. So, uh, I think he just confirmed that Big Hot Dog is not in Big Sandwich's pocket. Lock it in my pocket. Well, that guy's problematic, isn't he? That guy is problematic, isn't he? Well, we just can't get past this guy, huh? All right. You sure have gotten your slef. Wall of lost thoughts. All right, nothing relevant there. An exit to eternal might be slacking. But where were they going with that ever knowing might be? Oh, that's what we're looking for. That's the ticket. Oh, but I didn't realize what phase I was in. So. Another yikes. From me. I would have loved to attack with these guys, but alas, we, we burst through things. I'm feeling really bad about that now. Can I bonk this guy? Yeah, figured. Oh, I have to check. Hold on, let me check Hunter's email. I totally forgot to check Hunter's email. It should be forwarded to me. Actually, I shouldn't check Hunter's email. That's invasive. Uh, I don't know if we're boarding anything in here. I don't think I really care. Although, what they're... Those emails are intended for Hunter, not you. Oh, man. This is awkward. What I meant was I'm going to have to check and see why it's not automatically forwarding so that Hunter can get them. Yeah, that's what I meant. Come on, don't... Uh, keep a reaper. Accounts. All right, so. That's an e-federal crime? Oh, biscuits. I don't want to go to e-prison. Why does a dog get email? What do you mean? Do your dog, do dog, what, why wouldn't a dog get email? I don't understand.
Welcome back, Cyborg Huey. For those who are curious, Hunter is named such because when I adopted him, his name was Hunter. And I didn't have the heart to change his name because I think what your name is should be your name. That's your name. If the Queen of England can have email, then Hunter Kent, I agree with all the things you're saying right now. Um... I want to kill this thing because it's problematic and they missed the land drop. So this goes up to four, but it takes two. Yeah, we're just going to do one of these jobbies. And if they want to trade Senate Courier for a Steeple Creeper, I'm okay with it. And they are okay with it as well. What if your name was Hunter and your dog's name was Frank Lepore? Well, you know, um... I guess that is a possibility. What was Mike B's name when you adopted him? Shit Pickle. That was old Shit Pickle. Yep, we figured they had Thought Collapse, which is why we held the Rampaging Renhorn. Wow, they just hit three beefy boys. So Mike B gets a new name, but Hunter doesn't? Good plan favorites. Uh, Hunter earned his name. <laughs> this seems good for us, right? Now they just gotta redraw their little snick. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is a real haste situation where they go to two. I think they're dead. They, they only hit three lands though. So. in this creature it never gets old I'm gonna I thought you weren't supposed to talk about his <laughs> victim too is he is he though was that only game one God. oh that was game two we lost game one how did we lose game one I don't even remember game one I think I blacked out during it oh <sighs> This
This guy's got reach. This gives reach. I still think our deck is fine. Oh, what up, Hunter? Good seeing you in the chat, buddy. Oh yeah, here it is. That's the hand we're looking for, ladies and gentlemen. I think we're gonna mulligan this hand. Um, this is a keeper. Um, I'm gonna bottom this because we already have four lands. We don't need double red for literally anything in our deck, so. And, come on, let's be real, we'll probably just draw more lands anyway, so. Oh, what up, Peg Pegasus? And look at that, we drew two more lands. This is what it's like being right. We also don't have any creatures here, so that's sad. Guess we're just gonna end the turn. I feel like we're dead here. It's always summer, they'll never get cold. So good to be right? Not really. Wow, that would have been that would have been good at a different turn, a different juncture. This is where they go Sentinel's mark on this guy, and then they just have an unbeatable six seven that we have no realistic way of dealing with. It's always summer, they'll never get cold. You know what? I will block. Totally fine. Oh, it's indestructible. That's a good that's a good side effect. I should not have blocked. This is what I get for not paying attention all the way. Five, six, seven, nine to one, two, three, four. Four spells, nine lands. Cool. Cool, dudes. You might say the coolest. Who's having a good time? Raise your hand if you guys are having a good time today. Raise your hand if you think your opponent has the thought scour that they're just gonna they're just gonna counter this thing. Raise your hand. Just put your hand in the air. All of those people who had their hands up, you get absolutely nothing. Cool. That was a fun draft. I had a good time. I won the games where I didn't get mana screwed. I lost the games where I could not draw lands or I drew too many lands. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of back and forth. Let's claim our prizes. Oh, three packs. Fantastic. That means this just means I get 20 more gems. Ooh, 20 more gems. Come on, gems. Oh, yeah, give me them 20 gems. Come on, gems. Oh, oh. Oh, a Skargan Hellkite. Yes, mm, Skargan Hellkite, you see. 
shirt a hat draft? Why, Caspi? What is? I I'm very curious. What uh? What the what the fascination with the shirt hat draft is? I'm just I'm just wondering. I'm just curious. What do we do now? Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. You can check me out on Twitch, Patreon, meundies.com slash franklapore, manatraders.com, cool stuff inc. Use Frank5, you'll get 5% off. Check out all those links. Support me in all the ways you can, all the ways you were able to. Slam the like and subscribe buttons, do the things. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it.